So as you can see from the title, yes, a guy did shout in my face. Yay! Hey guys, how's it going? Just a very quick story I want to just let out to you guys. So this week, uh, I was just with some friends, walking back from somewhere, and then we were just walking, and then I was like at the back of this group of, I think there were about six of us, Then this guy that we were just about to pass, who was standing next to a bin, literally just comes out of nowhere, well, you saw him, but stands in front of my face, shouting in my face. Excuse me. He literally shouted excuse me and it scared the life out of me. It scared me to a point that I just reacted like Oh my god, like what? Because you know that's gonna that's gonna creep you out. And then because everyone else was walking, I just continued catching up with the group. Then our group split into half, and then half of us were going off to the station, half were walking the other way. This guy literally, as we were about to cross the road, this guy comes running up to me and he's like I'm sorry. I'm I'm sorry. And then I was like yeah it's okay just you know trying to carry on walking across the road and then he goes no 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 i i really like your hair at this point i'm like <coughs> okay <laughs> thank you very much kind of gotta go but thank you then as we were about to cross the road he was like no 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 but you really need a haircut. One minute he's saying he likes my hair. The next he's saying get a haircut. Don't really know where to go with this. Apart from what I said, which was I need to go catch my bus. So we kind of just carried on walking and went straight past him. But well, what? I don't get some people. I really don't. But yeah, I thought I'd just share that story with you. Anyway, so on to my fitness for this week. I'm going to update you just a bit of a brief. Um, overview of how my week has gone in terms of my health and fitness. So I actually have been keeping a diary. That's not, that's something else. Been keeping a diary. Yeah, oh my god, that's so bright. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna read it to you. I may have just come back from a barbecue, I'm not gonna lie, so. It was so good though. I had like a burger, I had two sausages, but I did have salad on the side, so it kind of outweighed it. So it, technically it wasn't that unhealthy. Anyway, moving on to a diary. So I started, um, I think I've been to the gym about five times. I think I've been to the gym about five times now, but I've recorded myself on three days. But I started recording on Monday, so this was after my first vlog on the Sunday. So day one, I went rowing. I went rowing. Day one, I started on the rowing machines for five minutes. Then I went on the cross trainer for 15 minutes, which burnt about 100 calories. Then I went on the bike for one hour and burnt 569. So yeah, I was really proud of that because usually I can only do five minutes on the bike. So to do an hour, I don't know where my strength came from, but I was just like, yeah. That day I, I didn't actually eat a lot for some reason, it wasn't like me, I think because, you know what, I, I actually don't know, I don't know, I had a tuna salad and I think because I made it really filling with like olives, tomatoes, peppers, carrots, tuna and sweet corn and I had a few nuts as well, so overall I didn't eat that much that day. But this is where day two comes in and this probably kind of outweighs it, where I had a salad again, but I did have some chocolate biscuits, but I did also have beer. Um, beer was a bad mistake, I need to stay away from beer. But I did burn 501, to be precise, calories on the bike. Then on day three, which was Friday because Wednesday I had uni and Thursday I had a friend over and went out the night before, so if I'm really tired, I found that I do better at the gym. It doesn't make sense, I know, but I think it's just because I feel like a robot so much that I'm just not there and I keep going and then afterwards I'm like, did I just do that? Then that day I went on the treadmill for 30 minutes, burnt 300 calories, then I went on the bike for 30 minutes and burnt 200 calories. And that day I had a salad and I had some dark chocolate. So I've been sticking to dark chocolate, so yeah. Then the days where I haven't gone to the gym, I've been doing things like YouTube workout videos for like the stomach, I've been using my hula hoop bit, I've just been doing a lot of things that you don't really need equipment for, sit ups, press ups, uh, just things like that in general. So my eating's not been too bad, I'm not feeling satisfied. So week two, I feel like I'm just 
really gonna focus a bit more. I'm gonna stay away from beers. Although, I did go to the pub yesterday, and what did I drink? Just water. I know, I'm very proud of myself too. Thank you very much. Again, there are things here and there, but again, I'm not gonna be so strict to where I'm like, no chocolate, nothing like that. Yes, yeah, so this is just a kind of quick overview of my week. Hopefully next week, I can be like, yeah, there's improvements, because at the moment, I, I'm not gonna lie, I did feel like on day three I felt a bit lighter when I was walking about, but I don't know if that's more of a psychological effect. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope if you're on a journey or anything of some sort, then I hope it's all going well for you. And if you wanna comment down any tips or anything to help anyone out in terms of health and fitness, then please do. And thanks for people who have commented on my previous video. It's lovely getting support, especially from those that I don't know. It's like internet friends. Yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll see you in my next update. Bye! I am now gonna go to the gym. Can I be bothered? Ugh. <laughs> okay. Yeah? Yeah? Okay. I, I need to work off this barbecue now. So. My dinosaur is just watching. Come on, you, you can be in the video. He's really friendly. Kinda just sits there and watches me do vlogs, you know? As a normal pet would do. Isn't that right? Yeah? Yeah? He's quite shy in front of the camera. As you can see, he's turning the other way. It's like one of those, um, you know those like pillows that you like, those car pillows? It's, oh my god, it's actually that sort of shape.